know why people just constantly keep just wasting their time in the morning, bro. Like, they literally just wake up like, hey, I feel like trying to cancel out Eminem. Knowing damn well half of y'all, like, have not met the stands yet. And I'm telling y'all, bro. <laughs> But when it comes to Eminem fan base, bro, like, they built different, bro. Like, they built different, and they do not play when it comes to Eminem, but anyone trying to cancel them, bro. But, 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 like, at this point, like, like, why do people even try? Like, why do people even try to, like, the government itself tried to cancel him. Know what I'm saying? And, like, people just steady just keep trying to comfort this man. When you're not going to be able to censor him, bro. Y'all are not... Like, bro, Eminem is going to say and do whatever he damn well please. Know what I'm saying? But but people just constantly keep waking up and just thinking they can just get rid of this man. Just like that. And it's not that easy, bro. Like, like this has been a hot, hot, hot topic, man. I'm like, I'm like Gen Z is trying to cancel Eminem, man. And it, to me, I just feel like it's just... A waste of time, bro. Like, like, like Eminem is not going nowhere. Like, his lyrics is still gonna be here forever. Like, even after we pass away, this then third, it, like, it's still gonna be here. You feel me? So it's like, like, why wake up and just try to just like downplay this man, bro? Just let him live his life. You know what I'm saying? And stop trying to clout chase, bro. Like, like, just let that man enjoy his life, bro. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, like this is what we're gonna be checking out today, man. Please make sure you guys like, share, comment, subscribe. I'm um in and out of the loop of, on like what's going on, man. But like we've seen this already, bro. Like we've seen this story already about people trying to cancel Eminem and do whatever works out. Come on, man. Come on, man. So we're gonna go ahead and check this out, man. Please make sure you guys like, share, comment, subscribe, bro. Like let's just see what they got to say about Eminem now. Know what I'm saying? For some shit that he did back in the day. Know what I'm saying? So, let's check it out, gang. So I saw Eminem was trending on Twitter this morning and apparently this is because Gen Z is trying to cancel him. And after doing some research here, I was able to find out this was all started by one video on TikTok. And I can't play it because the audio is copyrighted. Obviously, there's Eminem playing in the background. But basically, this girl wanted to cancel Eminem because of the lyrics in one of his songs. And obviously... Like, okay, like, you out of, like, a whole government, a whole presidency tried to get this man canceled. You think you're going to be able to just stop, cancel Eminem by saying, hey, 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 like, let's cancel Eminem. Like, who? Come on, man. Wanted to cancel Eminem because of the lyrics in one of his songs. And obviously, I'd say, like, the vast majority of Gen Z disagrees with this. This was not some type of movement throughout, like, the whole generation. But despite that, some people were just extremely upset by this video. One woman even wrote a diss track against Gen Z defending Eminem <laughs> over this whole situation. And Yeah, because they don't know about Eminem's stands, bro. Like, they do not play at all a single they do not play when it comes to Eminem bro they will they, bro <laughs> like and I'm not no down hard stand but I rock with Eminem like know what I'm saying heavy I, I'm not rock with him heavy know what I'm saying I, I, but like like some of these stands be going crazy I'm like bro I'm telling you it's dangerous, bro. Dish track against Gen Z defending Eminem over this whole situation, and it's just awful. So here's that. What? Gen Z's trying to what? Cancel Eminem. Gen Z's trying to cancel Eminem? Honey, that's cute. Listen, little kitties, let me make this quite clear. This man was around even before you were here. So what, you're all mad because the man was a lyricist while all your rappers are a mumbling gibberish? No, go ahead and shut <laughs> your mouth. Better yet, go and sit your ass in time out because boy was running laps even before you could walk. Hell, boy was spitting bars even before you could talk. So no Hey, well, uh, that's exactly what she... Hey, hey, I mean, is she lying? Like, 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 like this generation, bro. Like this generation 
is it, it's crazy, bro. It's like, bro, like listen, like growing up in the '90s, bro. Well, like if you're a '90s baby, you know what I'm saying? Of course you didn't hear Eminem when he first came out or whatever. I'm pretty sure Eminem came around to y'all in probably what, like 2000 and like what, 2002, 2003, like when he, like, like when y'all knew about Eminem, right? So now these kids that's been born in 2010, 2000 and, know what I'm saying? Up, you know what I mean? Like, like, like they don't know what's real rap and like what's lyricism, bro. Cause they grew up on the hump, the hump, the hump, the hump, the hump. Know what I'm saying? Like the mama rap bullshit, bro. Like, 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 like they, I mean, cause Eminem been doing this since they was even in the womb. Like when their mama was creating them, Eminem was already on this. On this rap guy shit, so like, I mean, just cause you don't understand, stand it, like, don't make make it trash. Like, you just need to catch up. Know what I mean? Like, come on, bro, come on, bro. Like, like he literally run laps around people with when it comes to lyricism, bro. Cause he is the best to do it. Just give that man his props already, bro. Stop trying to be a hater and try to cancel this man because you. I mean, cause he has mastered his craft. I'm just saying, bro. That's all I'm saying, bro. This generation is just lost, bro. Go and sit your ass in time out, cause boy was running laps even before you could walk. Hell, boy was spitting bars even before you could talk. So no, afraid you're null in, boy, dear. I'm afraid your opinion don't matter here, cause one day you'll grow up and see how everyone went and forgot about Z. There's so much I could comment on from that video. Yeah. She dissed mumble rap, which hasn't been like uh, creative or funny since like 2016. Not to mention, I mean, the most obvious thing here, we have a grown woman in her 20s, maybe 30s, dissing a generation of kids. And believe it or not, it gets worse than that. People obviously commented on this and called her like, I mean, comments are disabled, so I can't see them now, but I can only imagine. I can see why they were disabled. A grown woman here got bullied by kids into disabling her comments. That, that just makes this even worse. But I'm sure people called her like weird and told her how bad this video actually was. And she responded to those hate comments with this video here. So just to set a timeline of events here, this woman made a song dissing a generation of kids, a grown woman by the way, you know, she can vote, pay taxes, whatever. She made a Gen Z diss track, and when people told her it was terrible and embarrassing, first she disabled comments, and then made a video saying she was physically bullied as a kid so the comments don't affect her, which she disabled the comments, so I feel like she kind of contradicted herself. Yeah, you definitely just contradict yourself. Like, is how you... Never mind, bro. Never mind, bro. Comments don't affect her. Which she disabled the comments, so I feel like she kind of contradicted herself there. Right. But, like, how are you going to make a diss track on Gen Z and then get bullied by them th to, to this point? This is genuinely, like, one of the biggest L's I've ever seen. Right. So, with that <laughs> being said, let me know what you guys thought about this situation down in the comments. Let's get a, a rating of that woman's Gen Z diss track from 1 to 10. I'd give it at least a strong 9, you know, the, the dissing mumble rap bar was really creative. I don't think I've right. heard anyone do that before. Right. So with that being said, that's where I'm going to wrap up this video. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you're brand new to the channel. As always. Yo, that's crazy to me, bro. But like I was saying, y'all, like, like this new generation, bro, like, like, just stop. I mean, just stop. Just stop, bro. Like, you're not going to win. Like, like Eminem is damn, it's probably not even going to see, like, y'all trying to cancel him because... Like, listen, he had major other people just trying to cancel him as far as, like, again, the presidency. Now I'm saying the, the government, like, all these may, like, like, now I'm saying, like, come on, he really think, like, like, like he's going to sit down and, and listen to you like, well, hey, I guess you're right. I guess I'm going to be canceled. Like, get out of here, bro. Like, leave this man in alone. Let him enjoy his life and leave these stairs alone because they will fuck you up, bro. No, I'm saying I'm telling you, bro. Eminem's fan base is one of the, the, the like dedicated. I mean, the most loyal 
fan base that I've seen, bro. No cap, bro. Like, they do not play when it comes to this man. And it's well-deserved because his lyricism is amazing, bro. Shouts out to him, bro. Just stop trying to cancel the GOAT, bro. You can't cancel GOATs, bro. Especially when they got stands, bro. Like, come on. Like, get out of here, bro. Like, mate, I mean, of course, let me know what you guys thought about this uh, um, video. Like, on how you guys feel about... I mean, GNZ, like, trying to cancel M. I, I, I see all the comments. Like, like I'm definitely in the comments just trying to see what you guys have to say, man. Because this is crazy to me. This is crazy to me, man. And the SRT game. I am out this thing, man. Let's get it.